Hey folks, a warm night across the valley. Temperatures still in the 70s valley-wide. McAllen at 79, 78 Edinburgh. Harlands and checks in at 77, 75 degrees in Brownsville right now. These are still above our normal highs for this time of year. Look at our forecast lows. We're still looking at about 70 or so across the area. 73 at the beach. A little cooler when you get north and west. Edinburgh, Rio Grande City bottoming out at about 69 degrees overnight. Then tomorrow, look at these highs. Still February, 99 in Rio Grande City, 97 McAllen, 95, 94 Edinburgh and Westlaco, and then still in the 90s in Raymondville and Harlingen. A little cooler, but not much in Brownsville. The beach, the exception, at about 78. Tomorrow's the warmest of the bunch at 94. Front comes in Wednesday afternoon. We still get to 85, and the cooler air comes in overnight then. And Thursday and Friday, we should stay in the upper 60s. Some places might touch 70, but that's about it. By Saturday, we begin the warming trend again, but still not as hot. Even into Sunday and Monday, you're looking at about 83, no 90s after tomorrow. Rain chances do show up after tomorrow, though. Look at that, about a 20% chance of some rain on Wednesday. Then we go to 30% all the way into Saturday. Sunday looks like a mainly dry day, just a spotty shower. And then by Monday, the chance comes right back in once again as another front moves into the region. Here we go. Tomorrow, just hot. Temperatures, as we showed you, into the 90s. No fronts in Texas tomorrow, but by Wednesday, a front races across the state. And by this time, Wednesday night, it is south of us. Clouds build in behind it. And then once the clouds are here, they may not go much of anywhere. Thursday looks like a cloudy day with isolated showers. A little trough develops right on the coast, as happens a lot of times as a front sneaks through. And that keeps that chance of rain in there for Friday, even for Saturday. Sunday, probably the driest of the bunch. And then Monday, another front enters the picture and triggers spotty showers across a lot of Texas, some of them perhaps down here. So once that rain chance is in the forecast, it sticks around for a while. Southern part of the country, pretty mild tonight, 72 Tampa, Jacksonville at 67, up into the northeast, upper Midwest. Really, this isn't bad, except for Caribou. I mean, Burlington's 39, Syracuse, New York's 34, and then the upper Midwest, it's three in Minot, three. <laughs> 20 in Bismarck, a little warmer as you move southward. That cool air is on the move across the country. It'll cool us off, but not like that. 70 tonight, a little fog, then tomorrow back to 94. Hot and breezy afternoon after the fog burns off in the morning. Here we go, 94, 85, 68, and 67 Thursday, Friday with intervals of clouds and, and even a couple of showers showing up. That chance stays until at least Saturday. Isolated stuff on Sunday and Monday next. The chance for showers back in the forecast again with temperatures still topping out in the low to mid 80s. So tomorrow the hot day after that would cool it off. That's your updated first one five forecast.